after a month long hiatus, we are back. Welcome back to Africa Football, guys. And in this video, we'll be giving you our picks for some Kaiser Chiefs transport transfers. With these transfers, we think this will allow Kaiser Chiefs to try and challenge Royal AM for the second spot as Mamelodi Sundowns is a class above the rest. Seeing that the transfer window is set to open in a few months, we'll keep uploading these sensible transfers until such time. So, let's get started. Losing to Stellenbosch and currently 7th on the log, some changes must be made in the playing department. Our first transport transfer comes in the form of Wendo Rudaf. He's 26, comes from Namibia, plays for the wildcard CAF Champions League side Wanen Galaxy FC. And knowing us, we are suckers for a Shalulile type. And seeing what this player has achieved against the mighty Simba of Tanzania, this has given us that Shasha vibe. At 26, the player is nearing his prime and is hailed as one of the spearheaders of the Botswana League's revolution to take over African football. He started off his career at Black Africa in Namibia before his move to Bots in September of this year and has since become one of the prolific centre forwards to grace this year's CAF Champions League qualifying round. If signed, he will bring a sharp striking instinct some quick pace and excellent positional awareness for a player of his build. Seeing that Chiefs only has 10 goals in 9 games, an additional player like this is a must have. What do you think of this player? Let us know in the comments below. And moving on to our next Sinsport transfer. Our second Sinsport transfer comes in the form of Moez Ben Sherifia. Coming from Tunisia, this player plays for one of the African giants, Esperance Deo Tunis. Held as Tunisia's number one, this 31 year old comes with a lot of experience from all the continental experience he has acquired throughout the years. Seeing that Kaiser Chiefs this season has averaged a goal conceded in each match, signing this player will reduce that statistic. Ben this season has had two clean sheets in the CAF Champions League from two games and has been the sole decider for his team as they've maintained a low scoring qualifier round. This player, like all goalkeepers, has aged gracefully and is well vested in his capabilities. He has shown time and again that he is a modern type goalkeeper who can help as a midfielder buffer and exhibits a great distribution skill, which in turn helps his team build from the midfield and the defense alike. What do you think of this transfer? Let us know in the comments below. And if you are enjoying this video, remember to like and subscribe as we are trying to get to 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. And moving on to our last Sinsport transfer. Our third Sinsport transfer is Ogbon Friday. Age 23, he is one of the exciting prospects we are expecting to make it big on the African continent. Applying his trade for Nigerian side Aqua United, Friday is an engineer in the midfield. Friday single-handedly took apart C.R. Belu's dad in the last CAF qualifier and his build and frame make him a great midfield general. At this young age, he brings some European experience from the time he spent in Armenian league playing for Loris van der Zor. End of this season, he has one goal in two CAF Champions League games. He doubles in the midfield, but with a return to Nigeria, he has preferred to play as a winger for his side. Currently appearing for the Nigerian B-side, Ogbong has big dreams and a player of his stature can thrive in the PSL. What do you think of his signing? Let us know in the comments below. This has been Africa Football. We'll see you in the next one.